Hello and welcome back to our next part in the series on chest x-rays. So let's have a look at this x-ray. First of all we see that it's an anterior posterior view and that it's made with a portable device. This is usually an indicator that this patient is currently on an intensive care unit. Another indicator for that is the amount of foreign material that's in and on the patient. Those patients are usually very closely monitored and are usually comorbidly diseased. In this patient we can see that he has a pacemaker here prepectorally on the left side with one electrode in projection to the right atrium and one shock coil in projection to the right ventricle. We can also see sternal wires so this patient most likely already had either a bypass surgery or a valve replacement even though we don't see any parts of a replaced valve so and bypass is more likely. We also see two drainages that are put here into the pleural cavity. Those are usually put when a patient has a large pleural effusion, otherwise we can also use the smaller ones. We can also see here on the lateral side of the right thorax that here these dark parts are following along the sides of the ribs. This is emphysema that most likely occurred when the thorax drainages were put in. We see that the patient has here a free recessus, so the pleural effusion is already mostly drained. We see that the lung fields are both free, so the patient does not have any infiltrates, no pleural effusion or other lung pathology. What we also see is here these electrodes of the ECG and the respective wires of the ECGs that have been tried to put out of the field of view. That's it for this image, I hope it was helpful and thank you for watching.